What if I told you that the future of brain-computer interfaces comes with a hidden dark side? Imagine a world where your thoughts, emotions, and very identity could be manipulated without your consent. In a world where Neuralink and brain implants promise revolutionary advancements, the dangers lurking beneath the surface are more alarming than ever. By the end of this video, you will uncover the truth behind the allure of Neuralink and understand the risks that come with it. Let's begin. Number 10. Invasive Surgery Risks The journey towards realizing these futuristic visions necessitates traversing the challenging terrain of invasive surgical procedures. In the context of brain implantation, the stakes are particularly high due to the intrinsic risks associated with any surgical intervention, compounded by the delicate nature of the brain. For most among these risks is the threat of infection as breaching the body's protective barriers leaves patients vulnerable to microbial pathogens that could precipitate serious complications. Furthermore, the intricate neural networks within the brain, responsible for cognitive function and sensory perception, are highly susceptible to inadvertent injury during surgical manipulation. Even the slightest deviation from precision can result in profound neurological deficits undermining the very essence of the patient's identity and quality of life. Therefore, while the allure of unlocking the potentials of brain-computer interfaces is tantalizing, it is imperative to approach these advancements with a tempered awareness of the inherent risks associated with invasive brain surgeries. Number 9. Long-Term Health Implications Despite the meticulous design and engineering behind these implants, the complex interplay between foreign materials and the delicate neural tissues of the brain presents a myriad of potential risks. One significant concern is the possibility of adverse tissue reactions or inflammatory responses triggered by the presence of foreign objects within the brain. Moreover, the enduring nature of brain implants introduces the prospect of unforeseen consequences that may only manifest years after the initial procedure. The long-term interaction between implanted wires and neural tissues raises questions about biocompatibility, durability, and stability. Structural degradation, material fatigue, or corrosion within the implant could pose risks of device malfunction or failure, necessitating costly and invasive revision surgeries. Furthermore, the potential for neural adaptation or plasticity in response to chronic stimulation from the implant, remains a subject of ongoing investigation. Number 8. Limited Accessibility The prohibitive cost and intricate nature of the technology relegate it to a realm accessible primarily to individuals with considerable financial means or pressing medical necessities. This exclusivity perpetuates and exacerbates existing societal disparities as access to cutting-edge neurotechnologies becomes contingent upon socioeconomic status rather than genuine medical need. Moreover, the limited accessibility of brain implants underscores broader systemic issues within healthcare systems, where profit-driven motives often prioritize commercial interests over equitable distribution of medical innovations. The concentration of resources and expertise in affluent communities perpetuates a cycle of privilege where advancements in neurotechnology remain confined to elite circles, reinforcing socio-economic divides. Number 7. Ethical Concerns The rapid advancement of brain-computer interface, BCI, technology brings to the forefront a host of ethical quandaries that demand careful consideration. Chief among these concerns are issues surrounding privacy, autonomy, and consent in the context of brain implants. The direct interface between neural networks and external devices raises profound questions about the sanctity of individual privacy as intimate neural data becomes susceptible to unauthorized access or exploitation. Furthermore, the prospect of brain implants being leveraged for nefarious purposes, such as surveillance, mind control, or psychological manipulation, underscores the urgent need for comprehensive ethical frameworks and regulatory oversight. The absence of stringent guidelines governing the development, deployment, and usage of BCI technology leaves the door open for potential abuses and ethical lapses. 
safeguarding against the exploitation of vulnerable individuals requires proactive measures to establish clear boundaries, ensure informed consent, and uphold principles of autonomy and self-determination. Number 6. Dependency on Technology As individuals become increasingly reliant on brain implants to regulate bodily functions or augment cognitive abilities, there arises a concerning risk of diminishing natural human capabilities and resilience. Moreover, the pervasive reliance on brain implants for everyday tasks poses significant challenges to individual autonomy and agency, as individuals may find themselves beholden to the dictates of implanted devices rather than exercising independent decision-making and self-determination. The blurring of boundaries between human consciousness and external technology raises profound philosophical questions about the essence of human identity and the extent to which individuals retain sovereignty over their own thoughts, actions, and experiences. Number 5. Unforeseen Consequences of Neural Manipulation BCIs pave the way for potential manipulation of neural pathways by malicious actors. The integration of brain implants into the human body creates vulnerabilities that could be exploited for nefarious purposes, allowing hackers or malevolent entities to gain unauthorized access to individuals' neural signals and exert control over their thoughts, emotions, or actions. Furthermore, the prospect of brain implant hacking underscores the imperative for robust cybersecurity measures and stringent safeguards to protect against unauthorized access and manipulation. The convergence of biological and digital domains within the realm of neurotechnology amplifies the complexity of security challenges, necessitating interdisciplinary collaboration between neuroscience, computer science, and cybersecurity experts to fortify defenses against potential threats. Failure to address these vulnerabilities could have far-reaching consequences, compromising the safety, well-being, and fundamental freedoms of individuals who entrust their neural data to implanted devices. Number 4. Psychological Impacts while these implants hold the promise of enhancing cognitive function or restoring mobility, patients may grapple with a myriad of psychological impacts stemming from the fusion of technology with their sense of self. Furthermore, the psychological impacts of brain implants extend beyond the individual to encompass broader societal attitudes and perceptions towards neurotechnology. Stigma fear and apprehension surrounding the integration of technology into the human body may exacerbate psychological distress for implant recipients, as they contend with societal judgments and misconceptions about the implications of their choice. Additionally, the lack of societal norms or cultural frameworks for navigating the psychological dimensions of brain implants further complicates the experiences of patients leaving them to grapple with existential questions and identity issues in isolation. Number 3. Regulatory Oversight Challenges The dynamic nature of technological innovation in the field of brain implants, coupled with the complexity of neuroscientific research, makes it difficult for regulatory agencies to keep pace with emerging developments and establish clear guidelines for safety and ethical conduct. As a result, Loopholes may exist within existing regulatory frameworks, allowing unscrupulous actors to exploit vulnerabilities or bypass safety protocols, thereby putting patients at risk of harm. Moreover, the absence of robust regulatory oversight exacerbates concerns surrounding patient safety, efficacy, and informed consent in the deployment of brain implants. Without stringent regulatory standards in place to govern the development, testing and deployment of these technologies, there is a heightened risk of adverse events, device malfunctions, or unintended consequences that could compromise patient well-being. Furthermore, the lack of regulatory guidance may hinder efforts to ensure equitable access to neurotechnological advancements, exacerbating existing disparities in healthcare access and exacerbating social inequalities. Number 2. Vulnerabilities to cybersecurity threats. Like any internet-connected device, 
brain implants are vulnerable to exploitation by hackers seeking to gain unauthorized access to sensitive neural data or manipulate brain functions for nefarious purposes. Moreover, the implications of cybersecurity threats to brain implants extend beyond mere data breaches or privacy violations, as the manipulation of brain functions poses profound risks to patients' safety, autonomy, and well-being. In the event of a successful cyber attack on a brain implant, patients may be subjected to unauthorized alterations of their neural signals, leading to disruptions in cognitive function, emotional regulation, or even physical control. The prospect of external entities exerting control over individuals' brains raises alarming ethical concerns about consent, autonomy, and the sanctity of personal identity. Number one, unintended societal consequences. As brain implants become more prevalent and accessible, they may confer significant cognitive enhancements or advantages to individuals who can afford them or have access to advanced medical care. Furthermore, the proliferation of brain implants may exacerbate existing disparities in access to healthcare and technological advancements, widening the gap between socioeconomically privileged individuals and marginalized communities. Those who lack access to brain implants or cannot afford them may face systemic barriers to participation in various aspects of society, including education, employment, and healthcare, further entrenching social inequalities and perpetuating cycles of disadvantage. If you have made it this far, let us know what you think in the comment section below. For more interesting topics, make sure you watch the recommended video that you see on the screen right now. Thanks for watching.